new care on moon say about so you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll say later. What's up, I'm JR. You chill all right, let's get started. Now, um the last time I was here, y'all see me at prom me on met most of my friends. Now we had fun that night and I took you a little walk around the city at night and then I ended uh and then Catherine Kelly ended a newscast right there. Also her name is Ken Brantley. But you know, uh, we just had fun, we danced, and we cheered, and we swing dancing, but whatever, but, uh, we just went through some hard times last week, and then somebody just let me down, but, uh, that's okay, I went, I'm back up now, and I'm ready to get the newest topic. Now, um, here's the latest topic of all, I mean, this is serious, I mean, I'm giving y'all the information right here, right now, so let's go. And now, do you know the Al-Qaeda terrorists in the Middle East? I mean, they're finding a new way to do terrorist attacks. I mean, they have bombs implanted inside their bodies. I mean, surgically inserted them. I mean, I mean, there's no males in them. But if he does something, it's going to blow up. I mean, he could be uh, suitable for blowing up an airplane like that. So, you know, I'm just telling y'all, and I'm just saying, I mean, if a terrorist had a bomb inside his body, I mean, airport security would be able to identify it, right? I mean, they wouldn't be able to identify it. I mean, they'd just let them go. I mean, that is the risk of airline passengers right there. So, if you fly this summer or, I mean, if you go on a vacation, I mean, there are terrorists on bridges, too. They plan to blow up bridges, too, you know? I mean... They plan to insert bombs and bridges and just go, you know, I mean, I am serious for real, folks. This is not a joke. And, you know, if you're going on vacation, please be careful. I mean, just pray to God every night that the, you, there's no terrorists on the planet. I mean, they have bombs inside their bodies now. I mean, they're real smart. I mean, they could smuggle bombs in airplanes and just go blow them up. I mean, you know, you're in grave danger if... They, if you see a terrorist and they just blow up their bodies in front of whole passengers, you know. And they could blow up bridges too. I mean, they're everywhere for real. I mean, since Osama bin Laden died, I mean, there are more terrorists out there. I mean, I mean, America is trying to do the best they can to stop it, you know. And let's not forget about George Zimmerman. The latest update, he's free right now. I mean, but his bond could soon be revoked. Because he's not doing good. I mean, he got millions of dollars. I mean, he's not going to get ready for killing Trayvon Martin. And, you know, I don't believe it. Gas prices are going back down. But, you know, don't be relieved for too long. Because they are going, going way back up. I'm serious. I mean, I heard that. By 2012, it's going to go up $5 a gallon. But, uh, it's not going $5 a gallon just yet. But, it will be real soon. And graduation is coming up. I mean, I'm so excited about graduating. I can't wait to walk across the stage. Do you? I mean, everybody just want to graduate and get out here and achieve their dreams. And, uh, you know, I got them invitations ready right here. So, you know, I'm just going to get ready to send them out and just get my butt out of high school. And then I'm going to start working and go to college and achieve my dream of open up a pottery store. I mean, if I open up a pottery store, I mean, I'm just going to hire some people to make pottery. And I just wanted to, I could let anybody come in and do it themselves. I mean, I don't know what's going to happen if I open up me a party store and then sell party and then I go have the employees make it. So, you know, I'm just going to invest stuff. I mean, I'm just going to be the manager of that, you know. I just have big dreams too, you know, just like y'all. Well, um, I guess this is it for this weekly newscast. And, uh, on this week in weather, um, it's possibly, it's possibly going to rain uh, this weekend. I mean, I really don't know, but I'm going to find out for y'all. But, you know, uh, this is the end of the newscast. But until next time, I'm Jayhawk. I'm out. Peace. <laughs>